Hey, Pat Pirelli here to help you keep it natural so you can have a better horse life and so can your horse. Um, you know, horse sense and stable thinking, uh, I love all these little sayings and you know, over the years I've either made some up <coughs> or, or seen them somewhere and I saw one time that said, horse sense is stable thinking. I thought that was pretty cute. Anyway, um, I think one of the things that is really important is to be fast, firm, fair, and friendly. There's a perspective on fast and it's a timing thing, all right? So what we're gonna talk about this morning is phases. And what I mean by phases is that when we're, when we're wanting to get something done, it's gonna be important that we understand how phases work. And phases, so if we think about polite and passive persistence in the proper position, we think about the attitude of justice, and we be as gentle as we can, but as firm as necessary without getting mean or mad, or actually just have a, do it without getting emotional. Be as gentle as you can without being emotional, and be as, as firm as necessary without get, being emotional. So I'm just gonna throw the philosophy of that in before we start talking about the phases, because if we get into sometimes just into technique too, too quickly, it can be misinterpreted, all right? So this is, please carry that thought with you, all right? So I remember when I first started trying to really help people, just kind of get the idea, you know, hands that close slowly and open quickly. Why? Because horses, being prey animals, being born skeptics, cowards, claustrophobics, and panicaholics by nature in various degrees, um, anything that goes quick is gonna cause them to wanna panic, wanna make them feel um, claustrophobic, okay? so. Uh, and then, of course, the human being, being a not only a predator, but being a primate, our, our nature is to gr grip quickly and grapple and pull and lean, all right? Matter of fact, most equipment with horses is made, like um, you see a lot of reins, like for jumping horses and a lot of dressage horses, and they've got little um, blocks in them, they've got gloves that have got, sometimes got rubber on the inside, so it, more, it grips better. I'm, I'm the other way. I'm, I'm gonna, I want reins made out of that yachting braid so that it, I can allow it to drift and then I can regather, all right, because the horse is nature. So phases are important. So one of the things I talked about early on was to, let's just say we were, we were using game number two, the porcupine game. I call it the porcupine game uh, instead of the marshmallow game. So people would get the idea that if, uh, if, if I had if I had a, okay, how about instead of a porcupine, how about we think about the cactus? Okay, if, the, if that tree was a cactus, I wouldn't run up to it and say, hey, tree, I love you, right? Okay, that tree's going to stand there, and if I lean back, I'm not going to lean against that too, too, too quickly or too hard. I'm going to go, whoa, that's, that's sharp. So the phases that I talked about was first start off like a fly, then go to a mosquito, then go to like a blackbird. Can you imagine having a little blackbird on your, on your um, shoulder or something? And how they would grip and then go to an eagle okay but we don't do it quickly we, we go fly mosquito blackbird eagle and what happens to a lot of people is they go fly mosquito fly mosquito fly mosquito fly mosquito almost a blackbird fly they keep doing this you know the, the i think the thing that, that is the most important thing is that we understand that it let's just say that we say suggest ask tell promise okay fly, mosquito, blackbird, eagle, all right? What a lot of people do, and I've seen this a lot when people ride, and I say, okay, first thing is open your arms up, you know, open up and say lift and open and say smile, and smile with all four cheeks, all right? Then turn the smile into a squeeze with our legs, okay? Then um, smooch it and squeeze and then smooch if you please, and then take something like this, like your savvy string, and spank the air Okay, and you can touch yourself. Don't t touch the horse any harder than that. And then touch their hair, okay? And it doesn't have to get harder. It's just those are four different phases. Well, I see what a lot of people do is they smile with all four cheeks. Then they quit smiling and they start squeezing. Then they quit squeezing and they start spanking, okay? So that's like what I want you to do is think of each one of those A, B, C, D. A plus B. A and B plus C. A and B plus C and add D. Okay, A, B, C and then add D. In other words, keep smiling, keep it open, squeeze, but don't squeeze harder. Then start doing something rhythmic. That's where is, is the first kind of rhythm, a little bit. And then just keep on touching and off you go. All right. So it, it's 
learning to keep all of those. Um, let's say I'm going to send my horse in a circle. All right, if I take this like this, and that phase one would be on the circle game. I'd go over there. Then I'm going to lift this. That's you know, suggest, ask, tell, and then promise. All right. So see how I did that? I didn't have to get mean. I didn't get mad. But a lot of people go suggest ask and then when they go to swing in this they swing it way over here to make sure it would never touch the horse so now we've lied to the horse and we've told the horse i look you better get going because if not i'm going to spank that over there and they're like so all right so it's really knowing how to be fast firm fair and friendly it's the timing that's important and then since we're talking about timing make sure that we don't just stay you know suggest Suggest, ask, ask, it's go, suggest, ask, tell, promise, okay, suggest, ask, tell, promise, see how that, it, it, it's got rhythm to it, it's got, it, it means something. So, whether you're using steady pressure or rhythmic pressure, think of it in those kind of ways, think of the attitude of justice so that we're, we're, we're being as gentle as we can, but as firm as necessary without getting emotional. Pat Pirelli here, helping you keep it natural so you can have a better horse life.